Hi guys, this is Kevin with WatchHimTrade.com. Today's date is Sunday, April 12th. This is going to be a video chart on VLTC. This is a stock that exploded at the beginning of the month in April, going from a dollar to six dollars and thirty-six cents currently. High volume coming in for the stock, and you can see you're looking at a daily chart right now. And there is just no history whatsoever for this stock really of massive volume or anything like that. It has been in a downtrend for a really long time, just scrolling back and back and back along the way here. So, you know, this history, yeah, you could go back and look at 2012, 2013 and get some levels from it. But the volume is so low that I don't put a ton of emphasis on it personally as there's clearly been some dilution into the float and whatnot. But at this point, the float's probably traded over a few times. That's the only way you could have gotten from a buck to seven bucks. And I don't think the daily tells you a whole lot. So I'm going to break it down and look at a 15-minute chart here to get some better insight to me. So clearly here, you know, you have been making higher highs, higher lows, along the way. Let me just get rid of these post-market sessions so we can get a clearer look. Okay, so here you are. The move kind of picked up gear on April 6th when it broke above three bucks and has just kind of had some sideways consolidations, then another rip, a little sideways in the afternoon, then another rip, and then a fade finally on Friday. So Friday it did come down. What's interesting to me about Friday is it finally gave up all of its move from the first 30 minutes of the day and actually made new lows in the afternoon. And that's not something it was able to do at any other time during the week. You didn't really ever see it make new afternoon lows. So with that said, maybe Friday it's stalling out a little bit and setting up for some downside which would make sense given the trend. I think it's nice and simple though. Just watch six bucks. Six bucks is kind of in line with that afternoon low from Friday. You did close off of it. If you stay above six, I like it to test that Friday high around 720s, 730s. If you break down below six bucks, then you could see a pretty hard move back towards five dollars first and five dollars to me is the key level to stay above just psychologically as long as you're above five this stock is gonna maintain upside potential over the intermediate term going into May and June the summer months but if you were to break below five then there's gonna be a real risk of VLTC giving up kinda all of this move from two bucks up to four bucks because that's just the way things work with these small cap names once the momentum turns a lot of shorts pile in and the pressure can be substantial so five dollars to me is the key level that you need to stay above intermediate to longer term if you want to keep going higher overall six dollars in the short term is the level I'd be watching for momentum upside below six you can get a short move down towards five but I think you can buy the pullback versus five bucks break below five is where I'd change my bias outright and look for downside.